Okay, we are outside the active classroom touring bus by Promethean just outside of Atlanta Public Schools. And who are we with today? Hi, I'm Courtney Farnham, e-learning specialist with Atlanta Public Schools. And you're going to take us on a little mini tour of their bus. What are we going to see on the inside real quick before Actually, we go in? We're going to see the latest technologies that we're integrating into our classrooms of Promethean. And we're going to witness the interactive classroom. All right, let's go on inside. And we have one of our own on the right. So today I'm going to be presenting to you a, a flip chart about the body systems, the human body systems. We're going to begin with a video that I recorded earlier today in which you actually this have is the Lindsay opportunity Collins, as a classroom who is a teacher science educator with the Coretta Scott King Young Women's Leadership Academy. On the board and then to replay it for your students. So you're going to notice that a highlighter is going across the title. And as this is happening, you can walk around with your kids. And it's really good for classroom management because as you're doing something or they're seeing something on the board, they're either writing it down or you're explaining to them, I'm highlighting these particular words because they're the most important things of this particular, of this slide. So that's one really exciting function of the board. It also has sound. I don't have it enabled on this slide, but we'll see sound in, the, in our next slides. So once we see that, So like I said, welcome to the presentation. Our next slide here is basically just a fun way to um, talk to your kids and for them to write down notes. A lot of times in science classrooms, we use interactive notebooks. One side is considered your output side where you draw your images and it's just a more real life way of looking at your information. And then the input side is where you write out your facts. And so if you're a classroom teacher and you're up at the board and you want your kids to write down your facts, a lot of times um, you'll use the reveal tool and you'll reveal only the amount of information you want them to write down at that point in time. So in this case, I just want them to write down that the human body is, is complex and made up of thousands of individual systems. Once they've written down their fact, they then have time to write down or to draw these pictures that I have up here for them to just connect the information. So not only are they writing it down, but they're also connecting it by writing it down visually. In my classroom, I love for them to use colorful pens, uh, markers, all of those kind of things. So it basically just makes the, the, the text come alive. Um, the reveal tool, uh, we're going to continue to reveal the text. And this would be our next uh, fact that I have for the students. They would write down this fact, and then they would go over here to the output side, and they would match up these organs or this system to what they've written down. So it's just a real life way of understanding the information. Now we go to this slide. This is a really, really cool. Um, Who are we with right now? now? Please introduce yourself. My name is Kylie Moose. I'm a teaching and learning consultant with Promethean. And I'm Doug Knowles, senior area manager for Promethean. I'm John Curley. I'm part of the active staff and a presenter. And why are you guys wearing the coolest shades I've ever seen? Well, we're looking at one of our premier partners, uh, which provides the 3D digital content cyber science. And so Jonathan takes us through a lot of the features that are that are with this software. And this is just amazing stuff. You talk about engaging kids. This is just fantastic. And obviously, we can't. But appreciate it without our own glasses on, but we'll assume the camera can't do it. <laughs> but, but, but what it, what does this 3D experience do as we're revealing different parts of a frog like that? Go ahead, John. And then what you can actually have one big frog in front of the classroom instead of having small individual frogs. The teacher can actually guide the lesson a little easier this way. It's very easy to see. I can move this guy um, around so in all different 3D like aspects if I choose to. And I can also, if I wanted to, I could actually have my students go on a little field trip inside the frog's mouth. We can just kind of go inside here and see what it would be like if we were the human fly and we were going to go travel into the frog. So we're going to focus on the frog itself. That's trippy. So if we go on to our next page, we have the human heart. And again, when it comes to so as far as your visual learners, your tactile learners, and your audio learners, we have all three levels of learning techniques. How many people have you been giving presentations to over the course of this day? How many educators have you been working with? I've had probably about 16 educators on here. I had one gentleman who came in on the bus who was just walking by to vote. And he was actually an educator as well, and he brought his two children on the bus as well. And they probably stayed on for around about an hour. Let's go outside and talk some more. Okay. Thank you very much. Thanks. Here, we'll give you a glass. Yes, sir. Okay, we're still on camera here. 
Now, Courtney, talk about the importance of working with Promethean as a partner for APS and what value this touring bus is giving to our educators as they learn more about Promethean. Actually, our district has about 1,700 boards uh, within our classrooms, and the teachers are able to interact, make their lessons um, interactive. Uh, integrating their technology, their flip charts, as well as using some of the learner response systems, which will allow them to have access to real-time data. How good is it also just this day in terms of getting people into the bus and helping them sort of overcome whatever technological you know, speed bumps they might have and learning how to use Promethean. It so, seems like a really helpful bus and day for you guys. It is. It's been a very busy day, very fun, engaging day. All of the participants that have come over have really learned different things as it relates to the Promethean technology. And we had one of our very own from Coretta Scott King to actually come in and demonstrate and share with us one of her science lessons. We've also had the um, director from strategic programs and planning to come over and she was able to learn about our the Promethean's latest software, which is the Active Progress. So it's been a wonderful day. Thanks. And, and talk about working with APS. Why is it important to kind of bring this type of knowledge in this way to our staff and our educators? Well, Promethean's been working with Logical Choice Technologies. There's Terry Caldwell over Hi. there. Hi. With APS for about five, six years right now. Okay. And it's it's been a very rich partnership. Uh, they have. Uh, been working with us to bring this technology as quickly as possible into the classroom because it's it does impact very positively the scholastic achievement for the kids. In fact, the Dr. Robert Marzano study, which the second phase has just come out, demonstrates that at a minimum there's a change of 16 to 17 percentile points in improvements in AYP with this technology. Well, thank you for taking the time and good luck with the rest of the day. Thank you.